One, two, three, it's done! All right, that's it. Your lives have become too ridiculous and melodramatic. You all have to stop. What? Who's going to stop us? You? That's right. I challenge you to a battle royale! <laughs> Don't be late for your own funeral. The deadly dandy is going to make you into a fashion no-no. All that metal, clashy, clashy. Ah! Welcome to the jungle, fool! Time to prove that real wrestling is superior to fake wrestling once and for all. How are you going to bore us to death? <laughs> <laughs> you may think it's boring. But it's a sport steeped in thousands of years of tradition. A beautiful dance between two noble competitors that teaches toughness, self-confidence, and sportsmanship. That was beautiful, man. I want to join you in this fight. You do? You bet I do, bro. Together? Forever. Let's do this! <laughs> oh, yeah! The wild man just ran wild on you, fool! It's a double cross. You just fell for the oldest trick in the fake wrestling book. And you just made a big mistake, letting the tiger out of the cage. The gloves are coming off, people, because when you mess with the bull, you get the horns. He's speaking in the metaphors! Then this should be fun! Take it! The pain! All the... Wait! This is fake! I'm getting caught up in the ridiculousness! Need some discipline and self-control! Mind the gap! This is mildly uncomfortable. The bear hug is not very showy! But it is well executed. You win, bro. You win. Just let us go. Not until you say it. Uh, real wrestling truly is a noble sport. Thank you, Cyborg, for showing us the light. No, thank you. For this? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. Who's the champ? I'm the champ. Woo! That's what happens when you try to stop me. All you kids out there, I want you eating your veggies. I want you drinking that almond milk. Stay in school. Woo! No. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? You're so, you're, you're so cool. uh, another nature documentary? Do shut your stone home. <laughs> Chimney's blocked again. Who shall remove the blockage this time? I no longer like these birds who mock. They are bossy and mean. Robin was right about them. Okay, let's see what kind of trash is blocking this thing. <gasps> Robin! <laughs> who are you? Robin, it's us. <laughs> you. You were right, dude. Those birds are the worst. You have to help us get rid of them. Help you, help you, help you. Why? Why should I help you? Not help us, man. You gotta lead us, lead us, lead us. Titans, go! Oh, I thought we got rid of you. You got it backwards, friend. Oh, you're getting rid of us? Oh, you're getting rid of us. Are you mocking us? Get him! Birds of a feather fight together! Sonic! won't go! How did you ever remove them from the chimney the first time? Bird aside. Uh-oh, the mute 
mutated again. We have not mutated. Rather, we have evolved into the birds of the future. With our newly advanced intellects has come an understanding of the futility of conflict. You have nothing to fear from us, Titans. We have forsworn acts of disgusting violence and desire only to live in peace. Uh, okay. In that case... Filthy <laughs> mockingbirds! Not in the brain. Not in the brain. Oh, that's civilized. Hi, that was me, bum. Help me, Mark. I thought you'd be more excited. We have no idea what you just said. Oh, I'm ordering you a pizza. <laughs> that's right, pizza. Pizza. <laughs> pizza. <laughs> pizza. <laughs> Pizza, 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 pizza. Yeah! That's more like it. So, the toppings. Hawaiian, I'm a Hawaiian. Veggies! Crab necks with mint. Black olives. Yeah! Pepperoni! Quiet! What I was trying to say is I didn't have the money for toppings, so it will be plain cheese. Now, before we dig in, I want everyone's assurance that we will enjoy this pizza responsibly. What are you even talking about, brah? For some reason, every time we eat pizza, we end up fighting over it and running around silly and everything. That does not sound like us. Well, a little. Pizza makes you all do both goofy humor and goofy random humor. I don't want any of that. Understood? You are the overacting, Robin. It is only the pizza. <laughs> Look at what you've become, Titans. Running around silly and everything. You have to stop this. Because I haven't gotten a slice yet! Pizza, 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 pizza! Man, that was some good pizza. Maybe too good. Is it too early for the breakfast pizza? It's too early. And it's too late. What does that even mean? I'm Beast Bomb! You're all in. We want in the hive! <laughs> poor, poor Mammoth! It's getting too crowded around here. What are you guys doing here? We thought you could use our help. The mission is under control. In and out. Mayday! Mayday! Why doesn't it surprise me that this pit of despair has a soda fountain? So many dastardly beverage choices. We need more time here. Too many unanswered questions. How much time? Years, bro. Years. Years it is. Then in and out. <laughs> Our ultimate space weapon is complete. We're ready to launch. We can't go into space with them. We have to ask them to leave. <gasps> that would be rude. So how do we get rid of them? Only one choice. We have to blow up Hive Tower. 
that's the best you can come up with, it'll be easy. In and out. Weird. There's a bomb here already. Just need to set it. Whoa. What are you doing? We're blowing up the tower to get rid of you. Yeah. You're rude and mean. Hey! No lady blows this place up but the Teen Titans! <gasps> Beast Boy! This place may be evil, but it's also way too awesome to destroy. Titans, go! Here. Yes, especially now. Dudes, we've got to do something. They're driving us crazy. It's okay. I've got a plan. It'll be fast. In and... Don't worry, brah. We saved you one at the kids' table. The kids' table? Not the kids' table! I gotta sit here every year, rickety table legs that don't even match. My cranberries go rolling off. Oh! Let us commence the feast. No! I said nobody eats until Batman arrives. Where's he gonna sit? He's Batman! He sits where he likes! Now, while we wait, everybody just, just uh, say what you're thankful for. I'll start. I'm thankful that I was able to put together a perfect Thanksgiving, even though some people tried to ruin it. Ah! Oh, yeah? Well, I'm thankful for my cool new rat friends who understand the point of the holiday, actually, <coughs> Robin. I'm thankful my dad turned my friend into a turkey. I'm thankful to be here with my daughter, even if she doesn't appreciate my gifts to her. <coughs> well said, my juicy, meaty, delicious friend. <coughs> I can't help myself! I need to eat that robot ah. turkey! Food fight! Ah. Yeah. Ah. Score down! Take that! Oh, you little dirty boy! Go off the seating chart! <laughs> I ruined Thanksgiving for everyone. Yes, you did. But everyone's terrible actions have helped me understand the true meaning of this celebration. And that is why I am thankful that you are our leader, Robin, and my friend. <laughs> I'm thankful you always make me feel better about myself. Want to help me clean up my mess? What? How? It is the Christmas miracle of the Thanksgiving! Who did this? It was the rats. They say that usually they don't have a place to go, or food, or even a chance to see their family. Tonight, though, they had all that and more. They think this was the best Thanksgiving ever, and to say thanks, they wanted to give something back. A Thanksgiving feast! Oh. <gasps> Amazing! But what about the turkey? Oh, Dad and I took care of that. <laughs> Hey, only Santa says, ho, 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 I'm Santa now, ho, 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 That's right. Look at this belly. Son, you should see a doctor about that. <laughs> 
Blah, blah, I will. After we save Christmas. I told you, Christmas is over. What do you care? You gave Christmas up. I knew if the world missed even one Christmas, they'd be desperate to have me back. But I'd only return it if they gave me all the other holidays, too. Holiday magic. Now you garbage kids are trying to ruin it all for me. Ah! Ah, evasive maneuvers! Engine one is down! We can't outrun him! Elves! Battle stations! on Santa? Nothing on the scanner. Watch your backs. Kris Kringle doesn't go down that easy. Starfire, Raven, get the toys. Ah! It's over, you garbage kids. You ruined Christmas, Santa. I made Christmas, and I can destroy it. And now, Christmas is over forever, and so are you. <laughs> Uh, who's that? No, oh, oh, it can't be. Ho, ho, ho! Sticky Joe! You despicable bohemian. Ha ha ha! You're the garbage person now, Santa. Thank you, Sticky Joe. But all the presents have been destroyed. Hey. <laughs> Beans? This is beans? Sticky Joe has brought us... Beans. We got beans! All aboard! Beans! 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 A can of beans for every kid in the world! Best Christmas ever! <laughs> One dead man's coin. But it won't go any more. I'm good. Uh. Whoop! Dead man's coins! Expecting you. Come give your Uncle Death a hug. Then you know what I'm here for. Course I do. Souls. Shorten the lives of your friends for your own selfish desires. So very evil, Raven. <laughs> I love it. They were so cute as old people. Yeah, I know, I know. Don't you just love the big ears? <laughs> and their noses. They never stop growing. Did you know that? I did indeed. <clears throat> but uh, we're getting off track. You see, Rick, you had your fun with them old folks, but they're mine now. Once they took their last breath, I'm a soul collector, baby, I'm death. They're all mine. Yeah. Yeah. Last breath, I'm a soul collector, baby, I'm death. So come on. the deal. You trade me your soul for theirs. Don't, don't, don't do it, Raven. Raven. Okay. Really? Oh. Then it's a deal. First, you give me my friends back. Ah, don't trust dead, do you? Ah, I don't blame you. Here they are. And now for your soul. Yeah, about that. Don't have one. I'm half demon. You tricked me. And I don't feel bad about it either. There's always a price when you deal with death. Is that price free? Because I just paid it. See ya, sucker. Raven! Guys? 
Is... is that you? <gasps> this must be the price Death spoke of. Now they're old and undead. My two favorite things! I believe battling all of the villains in the epic fight to the finish would have been the much more exciting. Uh, wrong! Island adventures are what's exciting! Island adventures! Well, you can keep your island adventures. We're gonna bounce! He's going home! Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Oh, wow! Tisk, tisk, tisk. Don't you remember? This island is inescapable. We learned that in our first island adventure. Dude, we're sick of island adventures. Yeah, they're really lame. Ha, lame? Island adventures aren't lame. You guys just need to be reminded of how much fun we've had this week in the form of a catchy song. We found dinosaurs and had a dino fight. Watched a bamboo rocket blow like dynamite. Big coconut pies, you know the kind you like. We never walk behind them, I guess. Only the weirdos would walk behind the trees. Is anything real here? <gasps> the rocks are foam! <gasps> the banana has the microphone inside! <gasps> I think this crab is actually a camera. <gasps> the freckle on my butt looks like Mickey Mouse! Looks more like a meatball sub, if you ask me. I believe it is the unicorn upon its cloud of dreams. Okay, clearly it's a human skull. Enough about the freckle! It's obviously shaped like two bears high-fiving. Oh, oh, yeah! yeah. Bear. Bear. Yeah. Yeah. They're girl bears. Now, as crazy as it sounds, I think this is a stage and we are being watched. We need to find a way out! How about through there? A hatch. That's it! Something tells me this is the start of another island adventure! Oh. Me ugh. A rematch. Okay, sure. Can we sit on the bench and cheer us on? Of course you can. Now off you go. game is coming up and we don't have a chance. Not a chance. Did it ever occur to you to practice the actual game and not just your stupid victory dance? Practice? The game? Why, this could change everything. You know, I don't really feel like practicing. Me either. Yeah, that does sound like a lot of work. Then there's only one way to win. We cheat. No! Huh? We use our powers. We poke them in the eye. We take any advantage we can. This is dodgeball. We win by any means necessary. But Robin, we are heroes, and heroes never cheat. This isn't cool. Would it be cool if we let you play? We're, We're in. in. You 
guys may rule out there. But in here, we are the heroes. We'll see about that. <laughs> You better call the ambulance. <laughs> you guys are about to go down. Dodgeball style. I can't believe we lost. Uh, for the third time, man. We're not licked yet, guys. We won! By default, baby! Victory day! Sit! Ninja! So, what do you think now? You gots to teach me the art of the ninja jitsu! Very well. But you must swear to follow my instructions to the letter and call me Master. How about I call you Tiny Face? No. <laughs> uh, fish lips? No. Iron buns? Hmm, no. Call me master or forget learning the art of the ninja. Can't do it, iron buns. Then I cannot teach you. Ninjas, we go. See you, bro. Uh, I'm not comfortable by myself. I'll call you master, I'll call you master! Then your training begins now. Lesson one, disguise. Disguises let the ninja hide in plain sight. Huh? Where did he go? Ninja! Ninja! <gasps> ninja! So ninja trippy! I know, right? Ninja! You fools are blowing my mind! Lesson two, weaponry. Ninjas are masters of both hand-to-hand -hand and thrown weapons. Most notably, the shuriken. Shuriken! Oh, is that why Robin's so short? He was shurikened? He was born that way. If he was the shuriken, he would be even smaller. Actually, shuriken is another name for the throwing star. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Ow! Careful. Oh, it's so pointy. <laughs> How are you supposed to hold it? You take it. Wow. Lesson three, stealth. I will test your stealth by seeing if you can walk across that bubble wrap without popping any bubbles. Observe. Now you. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. No! <laughs> <laughs> The pops are so satisfying. I cannot stop. <laughs> Enough! Take your training seriously. We have to capture that MacGuffin. Everything depends on it. Now train! Football! That's starting to sound international. Sock him. Ow! Ah, I'm hilarious. Great energy! Now let's take the field! We look like the athletics professionals. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. I got me some shin pads, yo. Kick me as hard as you can. Seems like a bad idea. Come on. I won't feel a thing. It's shin armor, brah. Okay. Ah! Ah! You broke my shin! I, too, wish to test the shin armor. <laughs> They're not guarding anything! Not a thing! Ah. Oh, you guys playing sock him, too? Cool. 
All right, enough horseplay, guys. Let's get to the basics. Because no one plays soccer in our country, I've had this ball shipped to us from halfway around the world. Ooh, what a good-looking ball! Oh, a collection of pentagons and hexagons forming a sphere. It's made out of science, yo! Stylish. It is true. The football is the most stylish piece of equipment in all of sports. <laughs> now, this is an easy game to learn. You just have to put the ball in the goal. No problem. Huh. Swish! Two points! No points! You can't use your hands. What? Things just got super weird! But how does one manipulate the ball without using the hands? Football. <laughs> oh, dudes, we use our foots. But I don't have feet. Yes, you do. Oh, yeah, I forgot about those. Now, pay attention as I demonstrate a proper football kick. Ta-da! <laughs> There, I've scored a goal in the appropriate football style. Now let's celebrate by saying goal as long as possible. Goal. What is this, baseball? The goal. Unacceptable. Goal! Not long enough. Goal! That's what I'm talking about. Now, let's foot this board. Guys only think looks don't matter because they're all hot. <laughs> yeah, of course Robin's got it going on. They all do. But I'll show them a world where everyone looks the same as us. And only then will looks truly not matter. <laughs> Titan Sour, Robin speaking. Robin, help! Killer Moth has taken me hostage and is doing horrible things to me! Killer Moth. Welcome, Titans. Thank you for responding to the emergency distress call that I faked! <laughs> anyway, let me introduce you to my newest invention, the Fog Beam. It can mutate anyone's DNA. Soon, the world's population will be as disfigured as I am! <laughs> I'll never let you activate it, killer m- Too late! <laughs> Now that we're all hideous insects, looks truly don't matter. Oh, you guys look disgusting. Uh, you look nasty too, nice. genius. Ah, this is the worst. How will I go on living? You know what? Forget it. I was going to mutate everyone in the world, thereby eradicating the unrealistic beauty standards imposed by society. But forget it! I'm done! You never learn! I'm going to bed! Can we have the antidote? No! Now that we are freaks, we must live in a shroud of darkness. The world must never see our twisted forms. Never! Yo, yo, where's everybody at? Wait, Beast Boy? If that's Beastie, then who's this bug? Oh, that's Chuck, Silky's friend. I said it was cool if he crashed here for the week. Later, bros. Hey, why are you guys hiding in the dark? Because we are now the nightmare creatures, unfit for illumination. Yeah, aren't you disgusted by us? Let me ask you this, cyborg. We still gonna play video games together? Yeah. Raven, will you punch me every time I hit on you? Absolutely. Star, is your heart still full of love and friendship? Indeed. And Robin, are you going to keep on pushing me to be the best hero I can be? Of course. Well, then, it's like you said, bro. Looks don't matter. We're a family no matter what. Hey, wait. You said you were going to make him all but us. You look exactly the same. Nuh-uh. Check out my frosted tips, yo. <laughs> Uh, 
Let's throw down, fellas. Grr. Uh-uh. Fighting doesn't work here. In the dance dimension, you're only as strong as your moves. Let's dance! Touch any of this, yo. Just in time for the show, Raven. Ah. Oh. Are you gonna hand them over, or am I gonna have to take them? Oh, snap. Easy, Raven, easy. I'm a nice guy. I'll make you deal. Oh. Go on. Beat me in a dance competition, and I'll release your friends. Ah, oh. Lose, and I get your rhythm. You're on. <laughs> Well, I could dance all night, uh, but it looks like you can. And that means your rhythm is mine. Oh, <laughs> how smooth are your moves now, Raven? <laughs> oh, I'm like an uncle at a wedding. <laughs> How about you see yourself out, uh? You're not even good enough to be one of my backup dancers. What the hey, Ray Ray? Don't give up, yo. It's over. I can't dance anymore. I have no rhythm. There's one dance you don't need rhythm for. Drop the beat, yo. Let's get down to the overbite. Oh, so humiliating. But also, kind of fun. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Way off the chain! What are you doing? Oh! Ah, uh, dancing! That's not dancing! Oh! Ooh, girl! You're letting it all hang out! I can't watch anymore! Get them! Come on, bros! Dance with me! You're embarrassing yourself! That's not on the beat! Ooh, ah, oh, this is actually kind of fun! Oh. Yeah! That was ridiculous! I get it now. Dance isn't about being good, it's about enjoying yourself. Oh. Objection! You cannot object. They are your witnesses. Ah, you cannot object! Order in the court. I'll have a cheeseburger and fries. Oh! Order. Give me a strawberry shake. Oh! We will take a short recess. I think it's going well out there. We had a solid run. I'm gonna miss you so much, little buddy. Oh, bro, I love you, and I've always loved you. Keep it together, Titans. I've got an ace up my sleeve. I've seen enough courtroom drama movies to know juries don't care about facts. They just want a good show. And that's what I am going to give them. How are you gonna put on a show, bro? Can you do a New York accent? What's it to you? And do you know anything about cars? Yeah, my grandfather was a mechanic. My two uncles were mechanics, and my father was a mechanic before he became an interdimensional demon. Great. Just follow my lead. So, Robin, are you ready to confess to your crimes? Never. Your Honor, I'd like to call one last witness. Raven. <laughs> Ms. Raven, can you tell me what this is? It's a 1971 Skyhawk. Don't forget the accent. Oh. <clears throat> it's a 1971 Skyhawk. And is there any way that this car made these tire marks? Absolutely not. <laughs> I find it hard to believe you can know that just by looking at these pictures. Would you like me to explain? Oh, I would love to hear this. Objection. This is irrelevant. Overruled. I'd like to see where this is going.
There's no way a 1971 Skyhawk made those tire marks. See how the uniform and flat... How could she tell all that just by looking at a picture? Who cares? The jury is eating this up. Look at the chemistry. This is entertaining. Only one other car had the same body, weight, and wheelbase as the Skyhawk. And that was... The Enfield Hurricane. Oh, yeah! Thank you, Raven. <laughs> no more questions. Oh, yeah! The jury has reached a decision. I did it!